How do you feel about spiders? I'm not a fan. If he's in the house, he's a goner. Don't like him on me, don't like him anywhere near me. Typically I climb up on like one of the chairs or couch, whatever's closest, and then I just wait for her to kill him. <laughs> I think spiders are cool. What would you say your biggest fear is? Spiders. <laughs> Can we panic now? Well, I can't talk about that, personally. <laughs> My name is Dr. Sarah Stellwagen. I'm an assistant professor in the Department of Biological Sciences here at UNC Charlotte. I think some of the most common misconceptions about spiders is that they lack diversity. There are beautiful spiders, spiders with many colors, spiders that mimic all kinds of things in nature. You would never even be able to find them unless you knew what you were looking for. This is called Argiope arantia. They're one of our larger species. Spiders are very important for our ecosystem. They capture many, many insects during their lifespan. They're providing free pest control for everyone. So they're really wonderful creatures to have around. I study spider silks, specifically spider glue. We hope to find what gives these materials their properties. So potentially one day we can mimic this stuff to use for clothing, ropes, or in the case of spider glues, maybe adhesives. When we're testing silks and these glues in the laboratory, oftentimes we need to control the humidity and the temperature. So we really needed a way to control those environmental variables. It was suggested to me that Joel Dalton might be a good person to contact, and so I was able to ask him if he would be interested in helping me try to figure this out. One of the most difficult things that we had to do was meet the weight requirement of a probe. The entire probe could only weigh 25 milligrams. It's like the weight of one of the chromes left in the bottom of a potato chip bag. Working on cutting edge projects and new ideas, things that people don't get to see in their day-to-day -day life, they may have never even heard of before. That's what I like to do. Having someone that's at UNC Charlotte working with me on this has been just such a wonderful thing to have at my fingertips. I teach the Biology of Insects course, and from that course, I have been able to find students that have been really wanting to engage with entomology research and arachnology research. I've had several students that say, I wanna go into entomology now because I didn't realize that this was a thing that I could do. It's just been a wonderful experience to be able to get to know these arachnids so well. This small little creature can create something that strong and fascinating. It's just really cool to me. I really hope to change people's mind about spiders. We grow up seeing other people be afraid of them. We see it in cartoons and in media. Spiders are oftentimes the villain in a lot of stories. Really, there's a lot of different species and a lot of beautiful species out there.